Sitemap gives you a visual representation of your mind. Imagine this was taken as if we're in a plane flying over the site and I'm looking at the top of shipping containers where each one's filled with miners. So I can see there's four columns of shipping containers, A column, B column, C column, and D column. I can expand out each container and I can see the racks inside of each container. And if I expand out the racks, I can see a visual heat map that shows me how my temperatures are distributed. And it should look very similar to the interactive ad process. So when you're pressing IP report and onboarding miners, you're building this map out at the exact same time. This data is updated live down to the minute. So I can see a live heat map of the mine. You can also do a performance map also, if you wanna change the colors so your operators are looking at things that are underperforming rather than things that are hot. So in container A1, I can see the top two rows are very hot. We see some dark oranges, some reds, some yellows. I can see the rest of the, the racks look pretty cool. I can see some yellows and greens towards the bottom. So this one a little warmer, this one a little cooler. You also get visual indicators which miners are offline or need attention. So I can see container one, rack one, fifth from the top, fifth from the left, that miner has a caution sign. So I know that it's offline, miner not updating. And this is something that an operator would have to go check. This could possibly be a dead power supply. Further down, I can see this miner is updating, so no caution sign, but it has a red border around it. So this miner needs some attention, but it is not offline. Towards the right, NA, so a technician most likely identified that this miner was offline, went to the miner, maybe it's a dead power supply, so they disabled it in Foreman. So no point in seeing the caution sign all day. We're basically acknowledging it and silencing it. The foundational piece to Foreman is actually the location of the miner, the cell that the miners go in because a lot of attributes and other devices can be connected to those locations. In this demo, we have PDUs connected to each location. So I can click on infrastructure, and now rather than visualizing the heat in the mine, I can say, show me the locations that are covered by this PDU. So if I click PDU zero, I can see that top row highlights. If I click PDU one, the next row. PDU two, the next row. You don't just have to connect devices into sitemap, you can also connect attributes about your site into sitemap. So another example, maybe I want to visualize my power phases. So maybe I have a larger deployment and I'm leveraging three-phase power. I can select power phase, and now I can pick which phase I want to visualize. So show me all of the cells that are covered by phase one. Show me all of the cells that are covered by phase two. Show me all the cells that are covered by phase three. So now, Foreman knows what PDUs are located where. We also know what power phase each cell's connected to. So now when Foreman runs a curtailment, we're able to balance across the three-phase power across each PDU. So you come down fully in phase. 